Hello there. It's Motorsport Monday. Uh, I'm your host, Rob Zachney, uh, flying with just our producer, Ricardo, uh, as, my, as my wingman this morning. Ricardo, how's it going? We were, I thought we were driving. I'm sitting in a little uh, sidecar. Sorry, you're my co-driver. You're my co-driver. <laughs> Uh, or my 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 engineer, one of the two. My race, you know, race engineer feels yeah. more like what the producer role is. Yeah. Honestly. Um, but hold on. By God, is that Ryan Johnson's music? Is that the <laughs> Knives Out theme? Uh, oh just before we went live with this, um, my buddy from Through the Head, Troy Goodfellow, uh, tweeted something about this, <laughs> and so uh, Ricardo, I'm sorry, we have to put our stream plans yeah. on hold. It's fine. I'm here uh, for this. To, I'm very excited. We need to get caught up <laughs> on the Benoit Blancaverse, right? The yeah, the Blancaverse, Blanc. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that sounds right. Bla the, the Blancaverse <laughs> sounds good. Let's let's roll with that. All right, ready? Boom. Ryan Johnson, don't let me down. What is that? Is that, a, is that a monocle with a little knife on it? What is? What was that? Why, why are they using the Harry Potter? Uh, that wasn't a trailer. That was a teaser. Damn it. I thought we would get more. God damn it. Fuck. <laughs> That's it? Ryan That's Johnson, it. you son of a... <laughs> you son of a bitch. Shit. Wait, hold on. Oh, I'm no. <laughs> Kato, I'm getting a reverse diabetes ad. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hold on. Benoit Blanc's gonna get to the bottom of big agriculture sway over the American diet. Uh, all right, okay. well, you sent me another link, bust. didn't you? I did, I did. Uh, not Ryan didn't send me a trailer personally. Ryan wasn't God. like, hey, you know, here Damn you go, it. buddy. Uh, instead, I missed this part of the piece gaming uh, show the other day. But we are going to be playing Motorsport Manager today. Yeah. However. One reason I'm kind of keen on that is because uh, Formula One has a licensed Formula One management game coming out that, like, they just sort of took the covers off of. Uh, and so that is the link I sent you. Right. Um, sorry. I have a mouse situation happening, which means I have to swap mice between my two computers. It's real fun. I'm about to type this in because I closed Discord on that computer. I don't want to accidentally you are open kidding it me. up. Watch, question mark, equal, wait, no, V equals. No, this is fine. This is how production works. You just have to roll with the punches. 6M dash P N G mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Z Z mm -hmm. 5 Q M. Got it? Son of a bitch! <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna open Discord. Just give me a second. Um, this is this is a, a a warning to you all. Keep. Uh, what what are we supposed to do, Kata? You're supposed I'm, to keep I'm, I'm... extra batteries for your mice if you need batteries for your mice. <laughs> yes, yes, that is the that's that's why wire, that's wireless life, baby. <sighs> okay. Sorry, y'all. So Big which apologies. team do you think Ricardo would be race engineer for based on this? <laughs> Haas? Williams? I wish I knew what that meant. <laughs> uh, Zaxillium, my batteries are gone, Bono. I saw some people tweeting about a thing. Didn't a big race thing happen recently? Like a real big one? One of those fancy ones? Well, there are two big races this weekend. Uh, there's a very eventful F1 race, and then there's the 24, hour, 24 hours of Le Mans. Mm, Le Mans. Did a friend Fassbender make it? I wouldn't call him a friend, really, but did Fassbender make it? Well, I mean, I was very invested in his uh, in his fortunes for this one, and uh, he was there. He like he made it to the track. <laughs> okay. Um, he made it to the event. Sure, that's something. Um, I don't think there was a lot. My understanding is it did not go well. I barely got any chance to watch any of the twenty four hours, so I'm going to be catching up on this a bit. Uh, but 
my understanding is he went on the track mm-hmm. and then drove off of it and beached the car in the gravel. Oh. Uh, and so ended up kind of being towed back to the pits. Not sure what all happened there. Is this the trailer? This is the trailer. All Ready? right, here we go. Yes. Let's go. Oh, nice kits. Some good colors there. And they got the right Welcome helmets. F1 Manager 2022, the ultimate F1 simulation. Putting you in the position of team principal. That's where they're racing this weekend. F1 teams battling it out for a chance to be the next world champion. Choose your team and drive every decision that leads to you making your mark on the grid and hopefully. Oh, yeah, podium. okay. Winning championships depends on your ability to make the right calls on and off. This is track. A very Join races your mastermind strategy. Cut and paste from most for manager in a lot of ways. <laughs> yeah, changes on the which is good. Which necessary. is good. Okay. Yeah. Issue driver callouts such as instructing them to attack or defend, manage their tire wear and battery usage, or even to avoid battling a teammate, all while reacting to dynamic events like race incidents and fluctuating weather and track conditions. Are those attack and defend type calls things that a manager would usually do anyways? Yeah. Hire vesting class staff to work across your aerodynamics and engineering teams and put them to the task to develop your car and prepare new parts for upcoming races. Optimize your finances so, to keep the board happy. They're making the UI and scout talent from F2 and like, F3 to try and ensure match the F1 broadcast graphics. I don't know if that's a good decision. <laughs> I do not know if that's a great move. Data will help give you the sure. Edge. From the finer details of how car parts affect overall performance to a track's expected grip level to the condition of your wind tunnel, how you analyze the data and choose to spend your resources will make or break your progress. You'll find depth and detail and <laughs> approach rush even down to real world <laughs> team radio messages between drivers and engineers and race commentary from David Croft and Karun Chandok. While broadcast style presentation showcases 2022's striking new car design with real trackside and onboard camera angles. The sleek management menus and intuitive controls will drive the immersive. It doesn't always look like that, Kato. Yeah, no. <laughs> execute the perfect strategy in F1 That's like a lap one race. Pre-order the digital version now for early access from August 25th. August. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Little little belated birthday for me. Great. So we're playing... Okay. What is essentially the precursor. We are playing Motorsport Manager. Right. Yeah. Um, Kato, do you still have the power of a mouse that can stop this? And that? <laughs> kind of. Not really. Okay. That's fine. All right. <laughs> All right. Let it. Are we back on Motorsport Manager? We are. We are. Excellent. Okay. So I accidentally loaded a new game, but let's go to the main menu here. Boom, boom, boom. So the thing about Motorsport Manager is one, uh, like a lot of sports management games uh, that like are covering sports they didn't get the license to. It's all, like, <laughs> filed off serial number <laughs> versions of the actual sport. Uh, so I was thinking, instead of doing the the fake F1 thing, uh, I've been getting a little more into sports car racing uh, cool. lately. Cool. Uh, and so I was thinking we might do a new career. Oh, for tutorials? I don't think so. I've been, I've been watching <laughs> motorsports my whole life. I don't... I don't need tutorials. Rob Zachary uh, does not need tutorials about cars. Yeah, no, I, I, I know everything there is to know, except dampers. I don't yeah. know how damper settings work. Mm. At this point, I'm afraid to ask. Uh, <laughs> right, so we will go ahead with that. All right. What's a good What's a good team What's a What's a good team team manager name? Uh. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Where are we from? What's our backstory? Are we British? Are we British? Well, most, most, uh, like F1 organizations certainly are, but we <laughs> could be, <laughs> it might be thematic to be American here. All right. And I'll show you why in a moment. Um, great. what's a good American, what's a, what's a great American first name here? Uh, Brayden? Uh, Bra- Brayden's good. Brayden. 
Like that? Raiden Waypoint. Raiden Waypoint. Waypoint? <laughs> Weird. Yeah. <laughs> ah, yes, of the uh, New England Waypoints. I actually, uh, what's the latest birthday? We oh, we can't we can't give it our we can't be a five year old team manager. Damn. Pity. <laughs> All right. In our backstory, are we an ex driver? Did we have what it takes to be a driver? We could be nobody. No special wow. bonuses whatsoever. Damn, just coming in from out of nowhere. I love I like that. I like the underdog story we get with that. <laughs> but However, waypoint plus. <laughs> waypoint plus. Financial. Yeah. Yeah. Financial you helps know? you boost your deal on every purchase you make. Alright, now let's see. Thinking of me, but more distinguished. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. There, there, that's that's exactly that's exactly uh, beer right there. Yes, yes. Look, I've been working from home. This is me, <laughs> circa like 2020. Amazing. Yeah. Good glasses. Solid All right, glasses. Yeah. Oh, that's the, that's the uh, like F one team principal standard issue glasses. I don't know when they all <laughs> yeah. started wearing like little NASA engineer glasses, but they but they all do now. That's amazing. All right, so uh, let's see. We will choose a team. Endurance racing is a little bit to bite off. Six drivers per team. It's the races are maybe a little too. It's just a little too muchy much. Huh. I think uh, for where we're at right now. I feel like GT uh, sports car racing would be fun. Do we dive in at like the secondary tier, or do we go straight to like the high end? Wait, this tier one the high end? The GT championship is the high end, yeah. Okay, okay. And then this is the like challenger series. I see. Uh, uh let's just go for the high end. Yeah. We've got yeah. <laughs> We gotta live up to the financial bro mindset, the grind set. We ain't starting at the bottom. We're already here. <laughs> All right, so we could be a, we could be a good team. I don't want to be a good team. <laughs> no. What what gets the most bang for our buck? Being a good team. <laughs> Being a middling <laughs> team is probably where to go. Uh, however, I mean to say in the, the in thing... the in the idea that like we're a financial person and we're coming to like we're probably gonna buy a team. Is right, our budget how much we paid asset. in? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. So we overpaid for a team. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so I feel like okay. So we bought. We're like we're being smart. We're gonna buy a real, a real value, but we still pay too much. Yeah. Okay. And so we bought. <laughs> yeah. So we bought no. a distressed German team. Those bars are real low. <laughs> yeah. Uh, they've got good drivers. Wait, and, is that that's good? Uh. Yeah. Well, so it's green. Oh, like drivers, I sorry. British. I thought the first bad yeah. cars, good drivers. I see, I see. Yeah, we got bad car. We got bad <laughs> car. But that's not the worst thing we got. We have no staff. <laughs> like, we've got people who've, like, seen a car. Right. And we have no sponsors. This is great. And no, yeah, this is, and this our is facilities a, suck. This is, some, this is a new home we can build. We can build Oh, wow, team. okay. Wow, yeah. Wow. <laughs> so the different, we could... Oh man, look at the. <laughs> this is a team That's poised so to grow. Much. Yeah. And then this is. Like, this <laughs> this team. This is Waypoint pre Waypoint Plus. <laughs> this oh, is Waypoint no. Plus racing team. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I think we gotta build build from the ground up. Yeah. So yeah, it's gotta be in the ground. <laughs> hey, their, what, their livery is Waypoint Tail. Yeah. You know? Yeah. And Basically, look, that, look at that. Destiny. Yeah. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> wow.
geometric shapes. <laughs> God damn it. Oh. Yeah, that's very close to the waypoint green. It's basically the waypoint green. <laughs> Stop watching. Start winning. <laughs> All right. Yeah! Wow! Look at that! Look, look at their look at their hats and stuff. Yeah. All the all the right oh, color. Oh wow! What? What's going on here? We got a Norwegian redneck. <laughs> oh. Party up front and in the back. Perfect. Oh my god. Uh, he's a good driver. And then, yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, so, I think we might be in some trouble. Cost per race? Every time we race, it's going to cost us $1.5 million. That's mostly, is that mostly? We don't have that. No, we don't. Also, that's mostly... Look at that. That's mostly the drivers right now? I guess they're good well, drivers. I mean, they're, the only good, they're the only thing we got going for us. We can't very well... All the other costs hey, seem to be offset by chair, chairman payments and sponsorships. We need more sponsorships. We need more ad reads in here. We do. <laughs> uh, okay, so... We're in deep shit here. I'm not uh -huh. gonna lie. Yeah. Like we go to the like our first race is gonna be our last at this rate. Let's let, maybe there's good news in the inbox. There's always good news in the inbox. <laughs> yeah, that's All what right. that's what emails yeah. like in this game. No. <laughs> oh, okay, no. so we can. Okay, so must our, respond. Yeah, this this is how pit crews work. Okay. Got it. We can always lower the weight of our car by just taking parts off, uh, but it hurts reliability. Uh, but it does make it faster. Yeah, you play GT7. You know how it works, Kato. You did sure. you did this to a Samba bus. <laughs> Just stripped things off until it was less Samba. Barely a bus. Alright, so if we really want to get absurd, we yeah. can micromanage power boost, but in my experience, not a good idea. Okay. Uh, because it's just it's it's too micro mm. Um You'll see once we're in a well, you'll see once we're in a race. Okay, so our target. Can we finish? I think that's next to dead last, right? Ninth. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. Right. Well, how many cars is it usually? Ten. Is ten right? <laughs> Hold on. But. She'll give us an extra 900 grand per race if we predict higher. But we will be held to that expectation. Well, we need the money. I agree, Kato. <laughs> you know what? Let's overpromise. Yeah. And then maybe deliver. <laughs> yeah. And then maybe deliver. Okay, so I love this. Uh, let's let's see how Greta nags our drivers. Great. Dogger Stefansson is a fairly decent dr driver within the International GT Championship. The good news is that there's a huge amount of potential with improvement. He can become a real star. Uh, Dogger's greatest strength is his smoothness, and his weakness is his overtaking. That seems well, kind of important. Back. Yeah, it start, sounds kind of, back. sounds kind of important for... Uh... Well, Winning a race. Santo Parisi, in his international, G in international GT championship term, Santo is one of the stronger drivers on top of that. His potential is good. I can see him improving in the years to come. Santo's strength is consistency, but he has a hard time with his cornering. Okay, well, that's worrying. Uh, and hey, our reserve driver is low quality, but he has good potential. Um, this... Oh, that's interesting. Huh. We I could know, just focus, but he hates chasing. Let's see. He wants to get out in front. <laughs> I am wondering 
what if can we break a contract here? No. Uh, no. <laughs> no, we can't. Yikes! Who okay, has that, that sort not of a money? Savings. That is not a savings. <laughs> no. God damn it! I was thinking like, let's fire, let's fire uh, uh, Dagger and get uh, Gaspar in in there because he's comparatively cheap. But that's a horrible idea because uh, it would ruin us. Yeah. So no, we're not doing that. Wow, really starting off the back oh, foot here. What the fuck? Honestly, your lack of a racing background doesn't exactly fill me with hope. But I'm hoping that we're going to be able to work well together. <laughs> I don't believe in okay. you or trust anything you're going to do. So just listen to me. Fair, honestly. <laughs> hey, I heard you're crazy. super heard... rich! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Are we super rich? Can we just pump our I mean, own we, money? We bought into a team. This? We bought a team. Uh, yeah, yeah. We, yeah, we bought a team. God damn it. Okay. Well, let's see how this goes. Uh, this should be great. These are not good. Just a, a kind of, just for context, these are not good numbers. These are bad numbers. These are horrible numbers. This is, this is a bad pitch, bro. These people, like, we're gonna bring our cars in, and these people are gonna make mistakes. Oh no. Yeah. Make, make mistakes. Yeah. <laughs> are uh, we endangering yeah. the lives of our drivers with this pit crew right here? No, good. Well, I don't think so. The good news is, when they make a mistake, it'll mostly be like, whoops. I dropped the car off the jack, and now it's going to take like 10 extra seconds of standing still to fix that. Okay. Uh, sure. So you just lose tremendous amounts of pace uh, out on the track. Right. Um, yeah, this is this is not a good... Wow, this is a really bad team. Hey, we got four awesome. hires, good though. News. Look at that. Yeah, let's... But the problem is... Problem. So you're like, this, this is someone with some good stats, right? Sure. Yeah. 200 grand sign-on fee. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Yeah. So we can't do that right now. We have to we have to make it with this horrible team. Uh what contract do these folks all See, they're cheap. You know, and that's something. Okay, but the m mistake chance is pretty low, right? 0.2%. That's not Horrible, is it? No, it's not, but that's because... Uh, so, I will say, like, so he's a... What's he doing here? Why is he on the front jack? Is, is he really... Is he the best on the he's front a, jack? He's a he's a rear jack man. Yeah, what's a rear jack look he's like? He's a refueling guy. What are we What are we doing here? Uh-oh. Oh, dear. This, this team needs some management, is what it seems like. Yeah, we've got... Okay, they've got people just in the wrong place. Yeah, they got people yeah, in the wrong this. place. Okay, so we got a front jack man. All right, you should go to okay. the front and then. Yeah. There you go. And then. Who's highest this one in? Uh, yeah. Goes to rear jack. Okay. Perfect. There we go. That's some numbers. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Who's, okay. uh, who's eight, decent at eight, refueling? Four. So let's. Better than he is at tires. On. So get him off tires. Oh, it looks like. <laughs> oh, oh they, no. they do, the, the rear. The rear crew does both. Right. Right. Mm, right. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. And the front and the front crew does repair. Okay. I okay. See. Uh, what's yeah. T Gabaka good at? Rear jack. We have to solve him to rear jack. Yeah. Uh, but we have an okay rear jack at the moment, right? They're eight, but he's ten. He's just like two and three on the front is the thing, right? Yeah. What is he? Oh, damn. Okay, but is anyone? Hoffman. You got anyone good at fixing? Rear jack fixing. Shun okay, Shunaman should be a front tire person because they're right. They're not great at tires, but they they are good at fixing. 
Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> There's a one on refuel there. Uh, oh, my uh -huh. God. And there's okay. one on tires here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay. What about this five on tires? Where's that guy? Okay, he's there, but he's refueling one. That's an issue. Ooh. Oh, there's people in recovery? Yeah. They um, hurt? Are they just resting? No, th this is just like the... we had, like This is the travel crew, and then you're going to swap people in and out. Okay. Uh, because the travel schedule wears people down. And so the stamina thing, like, people get tired and they get more mistake prone. Which is, right, by the way, right, right, right. a huge and growing issue in F1. They keep adding races. Mm -hmm. um, and the thing is, they... Uh, like, the teams are only so big. And so... And also, the like, the people on the, like, engineering and mechanical teams do not get the business class travel treatment all the time. Uh, and, and so, like... The like these folks do wear down right. uh, pretty badly. Of course. Um, four six okay, four. So... These are these are our highest tires right now. Is the four six yeah. four five? Okay, hold on. This this person should actually be at the back. You're right. And this person. Uh, I think that might be. I think, I think is, that I think might be this is our, our thing. Yeah. Yeah. We've got the tens where we want them to be. Yeah. 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 I mean, this is like this. This crew is hopefully not going to lose us races, which is you know at least a place to start. Yeah. Totally. Uh, okay. So, the car. It looks fast. <laughs> uh, what do we got though here? What's acceleration is low. What's What's HAC? Uh, high speed corner performance. Okay, so that's okay. like the rear spoiler. Okay, and then medium speed corners, which is like suspension. And then where's like slow speed? I guess that's more an issue like braking performance. I don't know. Uh, so we could design a new part. Like, for instance, we got a really bad spoiler, and our engineer was like, hey, our, our, we need our spoiler's spoiler. terrible. Okay. We do need a new spoiler. That'll be a half a million dollars, please. Oh! <laughs> Wait. Design, like, from scratch? Like, we're building... These aren't... Yeah, like, uh. someone sitting down with a pen and paper. Wow. Well, okay. Like, CAD. But you know what <laughs> I mean. Yeah, it's still, they're, they're making... They're building a spoiler. Is they that, are. Is that that is that how cars are made still? Uh, yeah. Yeah. So I always I mean, assumed a lot like, of these parts would be stock at this point. Like somebody had engineered like the perfect one, and you just buy whatever. Oh goodness, no. Uh, huh. So the thing, the the thing is, um, God, aerodynamics is so cool. Okay, so this little car. Yeah. The thing to remember is every piece of aerodynamics is dependent. Like, front informs what, what happens behind. Right. Uh, and so the thing is, every single decision that every part of a car design ends up making, like, through the run, has knock-on effects throughout the car. Right. And so the reason, like, nobody's going to have a one-size-fits-all spoiler is because, like, at this level, each car is so unique and individualized that the exact contour of air spilling off its design mm. uh, is going to matter a lot for how the spoiler functions. Uh, mm. And and so, like, you do design your own. Um, and ditto goes with, like, the front splitter, things like that. Neat. Um, the overall shape of the car. Yeah. Like, like at these levels, very little is um, off the rack. Can you quickly explain what is this thing happening on the side of the car? Is that capturing air? Does that go somewhere? The scoop. The scoop. Yeah, that. Yeah, that's an air intake. So, like, they actually uh, so go the engine, into, like, the, the engine The engine is sitting system? here. Oh, yeah, the engine is here. Oh, okay. Uh, this is a mid-engine car. I see. Um, and so, yeah, there's a big, there's big air inlet uh, in there. I think there's also air being fed in through the bottom mm. uh, for aerodynamic performance. I don't know if it also gets... Uh, I don't know if there's a way to intake it uh, in the underbody. Or if it just spills off the tires in the intake. But, uh, yeah. Lucas Wordcraft so, in the chat has a very important question. Does it have a NOS button? No. Shit. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We, we need one. <laughs> um, this could look uh, faster. I'll be honest. Uh, okay. So we can't design a new part yet, but we can improve parts. 
Okay, cool. How much money will that right. take? Uh, basically, this thing mostly functions as part of, like, staff's ongoing work. Oh, okay. So, like, designing a new part is, like, fabricating an entirely new piece, uh-huh. uh, designing from the ground up. This is more like tinkering with what you got. So there's a performance team, and there's a reliability team. Um, so the thing is, we're kind of... Oh, God, this is bad. Um... Okay, so the reliability is decent on this. Yeah, so the question is going to be... 16 days to our next race. Yeah. Can we improve... I like that our guy said spoiler, but the game is telling us up there that it's critical that we get acceleration better. Well, that means the track is. So the track rewards, like, strengths in these in these areas. Ah, okay, okay. Gotcha. So the track uh, has a bunch of, like, shorter straights. So, uh, like, being able to quickly power down them is good. Uh, top speed is also good. But then there's hard braking zones. So that's where there's... There, so right. this is good for us. It's a track that I don't think is going to uh, affect us too badly here. So we have time to address some of these issues. I would say we can try to improve performance on this spoiler. Yeah. Yeah. And then we can improve reliability. Our engine's not very reliable, and that's not great. Um, Wait, why are there two would... of each uh, thing there? Are there just two options? We're running two cars. Oh, oh. wait, of course. I see. Yeah, I see. So this and this is going to become... Yeah, so... There's an entire politics of who gets what upgrades uh, <laughs> that's going to come up here as we go along. Um, but yeah, so we will... Ooh, gosh. Oh. Oh, that's that's funny. Why is the spoiler such an easy part to improve? Huh. Interesting. Yeah, that's a, that's a real quick turnaround there. That's nice. Interesting. Nice. Could you do it again yeah. if you ha- if it happens fast enough? Then. Yeah, I think we could. Can you queue it again All by right. clicking it, or would that just take it out? Um, I think. Yeah, it would just take it out. Yeah, yeah. But we could. Ah, uh, but see, no, it, it works in parallel. So we're yeah. So we're we're diluting. If right. we have multiple things going on, we are diluting. Uh, but. Hey. hey! You can improve the spoilers on both cars. Nice. Hell yeah. See? Already, we're turning this place Progress. around. Progress! Progress! Fan reaction? Did you see that email we got? Oh yeah, well... Good job on the spoilers team. Yeah. (laughs) Braden Waypoint. Alright. Hold on. (laughs) Yeah. Wait, was he complaining about us moving Pit Crew around, or was he telling us how to move Pit Crew around? No, that was just the old email (laughs) telling us how it works. Uh, So, yeah, the fans don't love us. Oh, no. Waypoint really good enough to manage our team? Jeez. (laughs) Wow. I I hope so too. I I didn't have plans with Santo except to put him in a car and make him race. Uh how long is that going to be? Oh boy. 2 weeks. He's going to be sick for 2 weeks. Can we call can we call in our our backup? I'm kind of tempted to. Right? Like I'm trying to figure out what's the like we'll need to pull up what the scale is that we're talking like I think it's like a twenty point scale, right? Minus three across the board is bad. Yeah, that's rough. That's rough. And also, also waypoint wouldn't make you work. Though. Exactly. Unless you like really unless we really need you, you know? <laughs> but... 
Gazetta de Matori. Oh, you bet I'll sit for an interview. All right, so certainly picked a tough task for our first job. We're expecting to pick up many points at all. Uh, yeah, you know what? We're, we're, we're here to surprise people. Okay, the whole team was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? The chairman what? liked it. The drivers are both the drivers both hated it. The drivers like their morale was reduced by the answer. Okay. No. But hey, you know what? I can't choose between my two sons. Can't wait to see them race. Oh and good. Now they're both they happier. both they're both happier. That's yeah, good. Yeah, they both love that. In the Gazetta di de Motori season preview, I wrote that you're expected to finish ninth at the team's championship. Is that accurate? Or do you think you can do any better? Uh, yeah, hedging, but still, like, maybe we can yeah. surprise you. A little bit of, a little bit of, how yeah, did everyone feel answer. about, okay, nobody, not, nothing moved. <laughs> uh, your financial skills aren't in doubt, but some pundits are skeptical about whether or not you belong in the world of motorsport. What would you say to them? They're foolish to question me. I wouldn't be here if I wasn't good enough, and I can't wait to prove everybody wrong. Okay, well, I understand their concerns. I have enough faith in my abilities. Managing finances is a big part of motorsport. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't nervous, but fans support me. I'll try not... If the fans support me, I'll try not to let them down. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I don't like the brazenness of A, but... Will it make a... How do you think right. the drivers are going to react is the real question. I'm torn between A or B. I feel like yeah. the, the weird thing is A feels like big swings, and I feel we need big swings. Fuck it. They're foolish to question me. I wouldn't be here if I wasn't good enough, and I can't wait to prove everybody wrong. Sorry, just had the channel total wait, up there for a second. Did our team marketability go up or down? I couldn't tell. Oh, it went out. Our chairman loved it. Chairman ate that up. Great. Thanks, Brayden. All right. Did race time? Or no, we're still out. Okay. Almost. So the next thing that's going to happen is they're going to finish up work on the on the stuff. Weep, weep. Hey, it's Gaspar's. Do we remember who Gaspar is? It's Gaspar's Who's birthday. Gaspar? Who's Gaspar? <laughs> it's Gaspar's birthday. Of course we remember Gaspar. Oh, thank God. Gaspar's hyperlinked. <laughs> Oh, he's that reserve driver that he's we need. That we need. <laughs> what are his traits? Born leader. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Nice. Okay. Hates chasing. Hmm. Mm. Okay, <laughs> but he gets plus five marketability because it's cool. Yeah. It's just too cool. He's just inherently <laughs> cool. <laughs> this guy uh, like I a feel loves like... doing wheelies down the street. Oh. This only happens in second. Right. So further back, you're Oh, fine. okay. I was like, I was worried that was going to be across the board, like, when he's not. Oh, he's that would anyone. be horrible. Okay. Damn, yeah. Okay, Gaspar rocks. Gaspar's great. Yeah. Let's get Gaspar okay. a little treat. Well, Gaspar's going to be the driver this weekend. So, yeah. It, it, it kind of, do you like Gaspar enough? for a $100,000 party. Why are those the only options? We can set out a card. Or minus a 10 morale? Party. Is a minus 10 morale gonna hit him harder than the minus three in stats we're getting from the sick guy? So the thing is, Yeah, we get no. He gets a card. He gets a card. <laughs> oh shit! Dilemma res resolved. Sure, let's call it that. Okay. Oh, nice. Look at that. That engine is much more reliable now. Green. Way to go. Hundred percent. 
Uh, I feel like I want to shore up the other... You know what I mean? It's like... I feel like our strategy here is just bank points from, like, stable races where, like, not a lot... You know what I mean? Sure. Yeah. We don't want things like, to break uh, down. Yeah. Other people are going to have, like, engines go out and cars explode and stuff. And, like, that just needs to not be us. We need to keep our... Keep well out of it. Um... And I would still... Can we choose who gets in what car? Uh, I feel like we can. Um, to give the more reliable car to the sick person. <laughs> well, we're, we're, I think we're going to keep the sick person out of it if we can. Um, okay. Alright, so Santo's car... definitely use a little love on the brakes and yeah oh my god <laughs> yeah well. we got alright yeah perfect oh and can we upgrade our design center? Well, let's see. Let's check out our HQ. Uh, so we got a decent factory. Wow, Ooh. I didn't know that. Look at that. We got a factory, and our design center is... Uh, how much to upgrade? Well, we can oh, buy them... Oh, uh... what the... Yeah, that's not happening. No. Sorry, man. No. <laughs> uh, what's the cheapest building we can buy? Nothing. Wow. We're really building... We're starting from the ground. The ground yeah, this up. This is... This is... Uh, oh, yeah, my not, goodness. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. We can't do that. Um, Maybe next time. Bye. Can I take him out of the lineup? I really want to. Well, let's see here. Okay, we got sponsorship deals. Ooh. They saddle wants... us with some. So, Shake Airways gives us, already gave us 450 grand. Is that? It's already factored in. We're getting 85 grand a race for four races. They give us nothing up front, but we do get 350 grand per race. That's good. Okay, cool. So this is where you like do a little bit of gambling to see like how good can we do. Eleventh or above. That seems how how big uh, are these races? I think they're twenty car races. Yeah. I mean it's the only offer, but we are wedded to it for six races. Uh so that slot gets taken up basically. If somebody else wants that front slot, we can't yeah. Swap them okay, out. I think chat needs to weigh in on this. Okay. Yeah. Like, this is because the thing is, six races is a long time. The season is twelve. It's right. twelve. It's a twelve race season. Okay. Uh, every time we do this, we make three hundred grand. I am not convinced that it is achievable. When we get to with our car, finish at eleventh place. Yeah. Or above. Right. Right. So okay. do we do we gamble do we on take, this? Like can, can we? Can, yeah. Yeah. All right. Poll is up for the chat. Do we take it? Do we trust that our racers will get to eleventh? <laughs> Not a lot of confidence in the racers. Oh, it's shifting. The votes are shifting. More people believe. It still seems wow, like we're not going to be taking people this saying though. I'm being a downer. I'm sorry that realism hurts. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, let's. Uh... It's very close. So uh, the thing, the no votes are definitely saying that. Like, also, the, we got two races to think about this, so we can see how we do. Mm. And then maybe uh, next and... race. Be like, yeah, hey. like if it if it turns out we're knocking on the door, uh, 
Yeah, but somebody's like, Steel Knight 2000 says, this team is very much in Williams' 19th, 20th place territory, which is harsh, but... Uh, yeah, we, we, we leave this deal on the table for now. Yes, it does seem that uh, the chat has voted no. We are not taking the deal. It's time to race. Yeah, can we not kick him off? I really wish I'd put this guy on sick leave. Like... Could... can you? Was All that right, even so an option? Oh my god, this is so brutal! He's stable, and the quote is, move to beige alert. What is that? As something, as something people around him would say when he gets, when he gets turned. <laughs> He's rock solid. He's also Great. a born leader. He's got that big ol' flu. Got a flu. Yeah. That's rough. These and numbers then... are still pretty good, though. Right, like his Wait, driver stats. I'm sorry. This man is 17. What? This this old man. This no. This ancient. <laughs> this Dagger, ancient. What Viking have you been we've doing? Fought out from a glacier. How? What did you do to yourself, my guy? <laughs> this this last kingdom motherfucker <laughs> is 17 years old. No. That's a he changed somebody's lying on a birth certificate. What the fuck is going on? You know, I he just really uh those those cold wind like the the, so the is that weathering. The, sorry, is that the Icelandic flag, not uh, not the Norwegian? I don't know. Maybe I I don't know which flag that is. Yeah. Anyways, those. Yeah, we were saying it's Iceland. Okay. Iceland. Okay. Don't need sunscreen on Iceland, yeah? <laughs> okay, well. Uh, he's a smooth breaker, and he's a first lap hero. That's good, that's good. Okay. Um, okay, but right, see, yeah. so if you go back to the other driver, uh, those numbers are already uh, taken into account, right? Yeah, I assume this is final, right? This isn't applied... Right after right. this, yeah, yeah, it should. It... Right, because you get the plus one from motorbikes, or whatever. Right, but they're showing the plus next to the number. I think that's fifteen total. Well, so what I mean to say is the other one, the, the right. flu already has those negatives in there. Yeah, right. His cornering would be ten, uh, but figure. now it's Santa seven. was the past. Santa's twenty six. <laughs> Santa's ready for the for the dust heat. Yeah. Just. Oh my god. Like, get. This man is twenty three. Hold on, that one is twenty three. <laughs> Hang on, we leave him home, and we are we are leaving him at home. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. We have Santa perfect. At home. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, we have Santa at home. <laughs> All right, yeah, and everything's uh, th these are these are all the parts that we already had, so everything was just improved. Content, um, unsure. <laughs> oh boy, Kato, feast your eyes. Look at that little circle. That's a fun little circle. Yeah. Again, the smallest circle I have ever seen playing this game. <laughs> this is the oh, worst no. team I have ever played. We are. Yeah. Wait, what's IGTC? Uh, that's the tier racing we're in. Okay. Fifth. 21st. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right. I guess we're racing. Yeah, we're off to Cape Town. Look at this funny saxophone. Are these real tracks? Are these real tracks? Yes. Oh, yeah, they are. Nice. Cool. Um, like, they're not using the actual circuit names, again, for 
copyright purposes. Uh, <laughs> but in general, like every track you see that's like the Belgium track is clearly Spa, even though they don't say it's Spa. Um, gotcha. What is feedback here? How good are they at telling you what, like, this will make more sense right now. Mm -hmm. So, basically, um, this bar is the air bar. For, like, somewhere in each, of these, in each of these bars is, like, the sweet spot for where the car set setup is. Okay. The pin is, like, kind of roughly where we're landing right now. Uh, and so that's, like, this is what, on paper, our car setup can do. Their feedback quality kind of determines how accurate these bars are um, and how specific they are. Okay. So you will, you will see as the, as the testing goes on, and we're in a practice session, uh, they will tell us more each time they go out, uh, letting us know what the... Uh, how they want the car set up. Uh, so I feel like... Yeah. That's some really short gearing, but, you know. Hmm. That doesn't seem to be Yeah, I can't... Much. Well, the cornering is going to be... Okay. Alright, we're just going to keep all the, the, the ballast at the center of the car, basically. Um... Yeah, all right. Tire chamber? Camber. Camber. Never mind. Camber. <laughs> yeah, Camber. Uh, basically, the, see this angle that the tire's at? Uh, oh, okay. So, yeah. And then negative camber, is it sort of splaying out like this? Right. Um... Also, though, these car these drivers are not going... The drivers will give you different feedback because drivers like different things in a car. Right. So, like, to an extent, even if one of them is giving you, like, clearer feedback, it's not like you can just take that and apply it to both cars. Right. Uh, because the driver has to, like, feel good about, uh, you know, what they've been given. That beeping from in the game? Yeah. Okay. Uh, um, They're gonna do another practice. Yeah, and we will take this practice so we and see the uh, see the interface. Um, yep, we're gonna send them out on that setup, and they will unlock bonuses as they uh, get practices in. Ah, look at the little car. Look at it go. Yeah. Like a little ant. <laughs> and then I want this one, because he's going to be on a longer tire. I would love for him to, uh... I would love for him to do a longer stint and learn something about race setup. The, you'll see where that comes in in a, in a moment. Okay. Now, the annoying thing is this graphic is fine. You know, it's good. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, mm -hmm. it's, it's cute and it's kind of fun. Um, this might actually be a slightly easier way to see what's going on. <laughs> uh, unfortunately. And uh, really, this thing in the upper right, the full circuit map uh, with yeah. relative positioning is, is the homie. Now, the thing that actual F1 teams have, they, they abstract the distance entirely and they just have a big circle. Oh, really? uh, showing track position, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, so that you don't have to like guesstimate how long it's going to take a car to go go through different like fast and slow sectors. Mm -hmm. uh, but we have to do that ourselves.
this first, this means nothing, right? What do you mean? What's, what, what is it? It says first here. What does that mean under? Where? Uh, oh. On his, on his little nameplate. Uh, well, I mean, it means he went fastest overall, but he's the first one on the track, so that doesn't mean anything. Okay, that's what I thought. Because he's the first one to set a time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Um, all right, let's... Yeah. Wow, those two cars are right on top of each other. Oh, no! Got what? overtaken. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's just... Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised his lap time held up. Like, I'm really shocked he hasn't already been, like, completely dusted. Uh, okay, so... Ooh, cornering so pro, now, handling for Knowledge yeah. gained. So see, now you can see the bars are narrowing in as he is giving us feedback. Right, okay. So he hates the cornering. Um, he said he wanted the ballast move toward the front. Oh, I missed that. Where did he... <laughs> that came up on... He, like, uh... he radioed it in during the, uh... Oh, okay. During his stint. Oh, boy. Uh... Are you seriously going to make me do the shortest gear ratios in history? <laughs> it looks like it. Oh, man, dude. I don't know, man. What about I the PSI? Uh, that affect it? It does. Um, like, we can lower the PSI to the floor, but uh, that's one of the reasons the speed uh, keeps going up. Right, right. Uh, so I'm a little bit like... Boy, uh, I guess we can try to offset that with camber. Okay, but he wanted front, right? He did, he did. All right, you're right, you're right. We And this is partly about calibrating, so we should give him more we'll learn more right if it's way off then we know it's not that low really like right, that we'll speed balance new. yeah <laughs> yeah Alright, so how many laps has Front has done here? Uh, let's have him push a little bit. We can we can sort of tell them like how like engine mode is basically how much fuel you're feeding the engine. And driving style is like how hard they're pushing the tires and also like pushing their own abilities. Was that him talking just now about low speed corners? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Went just putting in a personal top test. Personal best lap. Great. Hey. Look at that. Yeah, we did I did change the I did change the ballast. Thank you for noticing. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Oh no, the data, my data. What? What happened? It's raining. It's, it's raining. It's raining. It's gonna change everything. Fuck. This handling feels a bit worse now. Because it's, it's, it's raining, isn't it? Because it's raining. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> 
Uh, and it's gonna rain probably a decent amount the rest of the session. Um, okay. Is that... When is the race itself? I don't know what the race forecast is, unfortunately. No. Oh, no. Yeah, I mean, this could be useful data. Sure. Um, yeah, look, we're pretty pretty close here. Yeah. Just gotta fiddle with the cornering a bit, I guess, but... Yeah, uh... Move more of the ballast up front. There we go, right? That seems... Beautiful. Yeah. And we'll do another race trim uh, set. And it's going to rain, but never that heavily, so I'm going to put them out on inters. Uh, intermediate tires, uh, so lightly treaded, uh, good for these sort of mixed conditions. Okay. And he will go back out. Both both of them have little pictures that make them seem like they're 47, yeah. 48, and yet they're, what, 17 and 23 or something? When is it's like Somebody... 23? Oh, shit. Well, hang on, man. It was raining. Uh, how much is <laughs> left in the session? Um... Okay, so I guess the mechanic is the one telling us... He, the, me, the mechanic gives us our green bars. This is how the driver is feeling about it. Right. And so the question is, who do we... Tr well, you, you kind of have to trust the person in the car. Yeah. Um, the question is, which way to, to go, right? So I feel like there's... I feel like the suspension at 100 is probably just way too stiff. Like. Yeah, we were handling better before. If I'm... Yeah, well... Yeah, the, the one I feel like I, I feel like his ballast feedback sucked. Right. Bring the gear ratios back up a bit. Right. Yeah. All right, I feel like that's a decent. And yeah, we'll that do another right. one lap. No, that wet, that wet yeah. is going up. Track track grip is at down to none. Let's send him out on these enters. See what he can get done. How's Fuentes doing? He's on his out lap. Um. Tire temperatures are good. Oh, he's... Hey, you gotta get past that guy. Come on. Yeah. You can do it. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, there you go. No, 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 he doesn't nope. have him. He doesn't have him. I thought he had him. <laughs> Damn. Alright, you know what? Fuck it. Oh, this guy's ruining our... I feel like this guy is ruining our... Yeah, this dad uh... isn't great. <laughs> oh, God, oh, they're... oh, oh, oh. The weight distribution is feeling better now. Excellent. Great. Right. That's good. Can you get usable data from this? Apparently. It's bumper to bumper. Oh my god, guys. Oh! <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Those cars were <laughs> just a little bit in the same area. Suspension is struggling with all of these tight corners. So is it too hard still? I don't know. Um, no, 
challenge oh unlocked. Guess. And landing a spot on Fuentes seems happy, which is great. Yeah. I think we got Fuentes locked in. Stephenson, however. Could be happier. Yeah. I also did. Did we even get qualifying trim uh, bonus unlocked? I don't think so. Oh, okay. The handling's better. Oh God. <laughs> uh, and I don't think we're gonna be able to get him out in time. No, you don't have enough time. No. Damn. Did we change anything at this point? We can before qualifying. Um, right. So we've got that going for us. Time to make random changes regardless and hope they work. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, shit. Didn't they say Stephenson's feedback was not as good as Fuentes's? Like, just in general, like, as far as help being helpful? His helpful? Yeah, his, like, uh, knowledge rating or whatever? Yeah. I think so. I think we can... Wait. This isn't... Uh... What? They misidentified the... <laughs> the newspaper <laughs> misidentified who was out there. Wow. Um, which, if that's real, if that is like, if that is not just like an error, but it's yeah. actually something they do, that'd be very that, funny. Yeah, that would be very funny. Um, like, no, not that guy. Different guy. <laughs> like that, because like the F1 commentators do that all the fucking time. Right. They just assume who's in the car. Okay, so. Yeah, because his feedback, uh, feedback, no, his feedback level's 13, and so it's possible that he's accurate, and Fuentes was happy because he's a kind of a dumbass. <laughs> you know what I mean? He might as well, like, yeah, I love it. Sure. It's great. Feels great. Right. Super stoked. Uh, hang on, what's the, what's the weather report today? Sunny, well, sunny, we sunny. Only... Looks sunny, then cloudy. Yeah. Then sunny again. I think we're, we're probably good on. Uh... Okay. All right. Now. So yeah. So the, the, those those bonuses we unlock just like global bonuses uh, for the for the stage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and now. We can desperately try to fix this guy's car. I guess back to hard suspension. Wait, well, he, he was complaining about the suspension on the on the corners. Yeah, but what did he say? Hold on, what did he say? This new suspension can't handle these fast corners. I think. Right. I think I believe something like that. I don't know. It could be the if thing they is use like use setup buttons on the right to check previous stints. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah. So we moved okay. from very poor to... Mm. Do you want lower speed cornering still? The only thing I'm happy with is speed balance, and I feel like I'm happy leaving it there. Handling was okay, and then it got worse when we went understeer, and then... 
we went back up from understeer to no okay so i feel like he's never been happy and we've never gotten cornering like much to the left of this and i do wonder if we just try to like Maybe he did. Maybe he really did want. Yeah. Yeah. Front, front palace. And where's handling has also never been very far to the left. Yeah. Well, it got worse there though, huh? And, if, and, the, and you use the top one. <laughs> if you go mouse over the top yeah. one, and then when you go to the next one. Yeah, you're it, right. It got worse when it went to the left. So actually, we might want to bump it more towards the center, if we can. Which honestly, if he wants the cornering lower, which I think is kind of what we... One, can we do one more tick of the suspension? We can, but that's actually the closest we've No, I mean the other way, wood. sorry. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Because right. I think he does it, he liked it less yeah. when we went further towards understeer, so. Yeah. I feel like this is good, right? Yeah, I think this is probably. I mean, we don't know. Yeah, we're unsure. We're going to find yeah. out. <laughs> Are you really going to let a 17 year old who looks like a retiree tell you how a car should be set up? Look, he's a wonderkind! <laughs> he knows his shit! Look at that mustache! Man. You think you could have that mustache if you didn't know his shit? <laughs> and he's perfectly happy, so I'm just gonna let him drive. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let Bartlett be Bartlett. Alright, so we're gonna skip the qualifying sessions. Um, we're just gonna let that happen automatically, because there's really not much for us to do. Okay. Um... And it's a knockout go. qualifying. We okay? No, we are not. We do not. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no! What happened? <laughs> we had such a good time before. This is welcome, welcome <laughs> to the agony of the uh, like bottom of the table racing team, like. <laughs> This happens routinely, is like the shitty teams like pour their guts into practice <laughs> sessions, and then on qualifying day they just get utterly rinsed. <laughs> what? Yup. Okay. Okay. Uh... No, no, no. So we were asking, do we do we get knocked out of the race? No, 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 no. Uh, it means that. So right now they are setting who's going to start 11th through 15th on the grid. We are starting uh, like 17th and 18th, 18th on the grid. Yeah, we did. At least we didn't come in last. That's right. <laughs> That's the way to look at it. Okay. So. You know what, though? Through clever strategy, uh huh, I think we can make up a lot of ground in this race. Wow, this fan! I like how yeah. I like how the people have either self-identified or the algorithm. I don't know who where this information is coming from, but fan. 
Hashtag discipline. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's pouring on race die. Oh, shit. Interesting. Uh, and Interesting. It is, but it will dry. So do we run in intermediates the whole time? That's my feeling, is that we start on enters when we bat toward the back of the grid. Yes. Yes. Kata. Yeah, yeah, great. <laughs> I think it's going to dry out. And so I think we'll want the softs. And then we will start them on a... I don't want to give too much ground at the start, but like... Well, we'll see. We'll see. We just have to pick up our setup? We could also... take weight off the car. Like, how, do, how reliable do our bad spoilers really need to be? Yeah, right? Get a little bit more performance out of it. Okay, but they're yeah. saying the brakes are crucial. Yeah, I don't want to mess with the brakes. Um... I don't want to mess with the gearbox. I actually don't see a lot of opportunities. <laughs> well, I mean, we did dump a lot of uh, effort into making the engine more reliable, so right. we can take some stuff off the engine. There you go. And it's still the most reliable component on the car. What about that spoiler? Uh, Do that spoiler, too. Why not? Yeah, fuck it. Yeah! <laughs> You also take some fuel off the car. Does that mean they'll have to pit earlier, though? We're gonna have to come into the pits anyway for fuel. Um, well, we're gonna have to pit when the track dries up. Sure. But fuel is like one of the slowest things to have to put in the car, so you don't want it's a thirty-seven lap race. But it is. But also, like the heavier the car, the more it wears uh, the start of the, and the harder it is to drive. I feel like. I feel like we take a little bit of fuel off. Okay. That's my that's my feeling. All right. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, we are. <laughs> this is, look, so, to be clear, Kato, yeah. the game thinks this is a horrible fucking decision. Right. Why? why? Is it... Would it know? You don't... The game doesn't... The, the game can't conceive of my strategy. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Pretty wet out there. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to flinch here and put them <laughs> on a conserve strategy. And we'll turn the engine down, too. So we can actually... So this is going to hurt us less now because we're going to turn the engines down. Uh, because speed is less, like, raw speed is less useful here. Right. So we are going to, uh, like, not run the engines hard. And so right now, see, it's basing, like, its projected fuel burn, how much is left in the tank. Right. We slowed that rate down quite a bit.
like this is fine. We 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 should be losing positions at this point in the race. Okay. I'll trust you. Like so, this lap is the last of like the heaviest rain. All right, so he's saying no. Drive the goddamn car. They both want so wet. So he's saying we are being so conservative. There. Oh shit. Yeah. So we also forgot to put them on automatic automatic battery deployment. Um, now they're doing that. So. Oh right. This is the micro you were talking about. Yeah, we're not. So we might have let let too much heat go out of the tires. Um, so we might need to crank it up just a little bit. Okay, those numbers aren't great. <laughs> no. However, so the track is going to start drying off in about a lap. The rain's going to start to slacken. And the wets that the other cars are on are going to start pumping water off the track. Uh, at which point, the track will begin to get more suitable for inter. See, the inner temperature is starting to come up, so we're getting more performance out of the tires now. Okay. Um, you want tire temperature gauge, like, toward the middle. Okay, the track okay. is still soaked, but soon oh, it should no. stop. What? Oh no! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> what, Rob? What? What? What happened? It's not going to stop raining, Kato. <laughs> no. No, there's just going to be a brief window where it's the rain eases. Um, oh my god. But, yeah. Oh. Yeah, plus 30 seems like a lot to make up. Yeah. Yeah, it was. Censored by GMA. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I mean, we made one couple places. Whoa! Because everyone pit for enters. So uh, this is the part where... Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. The strategy is coming together! <laughs> Until we have to pick. <laughs> well, yes, but hold on. The thing is, Kato, we're going to save ourselves an entire pit stop. It's going to start pouring again. We're right. going to pit off the enters once on the wets. At the end. And then just be on the yes. wets. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. So. And you were worried about, look at this. We're going to get above 11th. <laughs> I'm sure about it. Because they're gonna have to, they're gonna all have to pit back to wets, right? Like this is yep. what the computer will do. Yeah, they're all like everyone here is gonna have to pit back to wets. Amazing, amazing. Yeah. <laughs> so the track is almost gonna dry off. Yeah. And we're actually going to go into tire conservation mode just a little bit because the tires are getting a little hot. Um, because the track is dry, so they're getting too much friction. 
like right now the inters are being hurt by driving if the track right. is too dry for them but here comes the rain here comes the rain <laughs> Okay, so... We pit them on the next one? We're gonna pit him now. Yeah. So, yeah. because he's gonna have a long stop. Right. We're gonna get him on wets. Can he fuel up... for the rest of the race? Yeah, how much race That gets him... That'll get him laps. to... Oh, uh, God, that's not enough. Yeah. What's a hold on, what's the weather like? Are we gonna have to switch back to intermediates at some point? Not that it, it looks like it's gonna be rain. Rain, just throughout. rain all the way. As far as we can say. As far as right. we can say. If it does ease, Let's see. It's gonna get him left twenty-four. Uh, this will split it, right? Twelve. Yeah. We, exactly. In terms of our strategy, I just mean uh, mm. we'll have to pit at least once more to fuel. Yeah. In the in the in the next wait, what is um in the next twelve laps then? Yeah. Uh, what is the on the on the thing? How far we cut down could we see on the forecast? How many laps can you see? We can see the lap eighteen, but it looks like e even there it's still raining after that right, lap right. eighteen. So I think. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe that. You know what? This is going to be one of the slowest. I think this is going to be one of the slowest portions of the race. Uh, so time here is going to be less expensive in terms of fueling. Right. Um, under the assumption that like it might start to dry off later, um, or even it's going to be on the appropriate tire, but I think here is where we kind of fuel up and we see what happens. Um, okay. Yeah. And we did put him on full wets, right? Yep. Yeah. Yep. All right. Should we pit him as well or uh Look at his t his tire, right? Like I know, yeah. I think he's got one more in him. Okay. I don't want to double stack him, you know. The other guy's going to be blocking the pits the pit stop for right, him. Right, right. Okay. Because there's only one crew. I see. Oh, the fuel! Get out of there! Now we can fit him, right? Yeah. Still looking, still looking wet. Yep. But we can't, that, that is slacking rain at like lap 19. Right. Uh, so, it might... so. Yeah. Okay. Lap 19 is what? That's... F well, let's see. We're on lap... Six laps away? Yeah. Alright. I think this is as good as yeah. we can get for now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. We have to go record a podcast soon. Oh, uh, yeah. Can you just... 
ping them. It'll be like probably five, ten more minutes. On yeah. This. Yes. We should finish this race. Yep. All right. So Fuentes is. Oh, this is so. This is really good, though. This is really good for Fuentes. Yeah, yeah. He is the front runner of the guys on wets. Great. Probably turn the engines down a little bit to save fuel because, like, how fast can they safely go in this rain? True. Like, once conditions start to dry off, maybe a little bit. Wait, so I missed. How long was the pit stop? Did did they did they botch the pit stop? No, it seemed pretty quick. I don't know if in-game time is who fucked up. Thirteen seconds. There was a fuel error. Okay. I missed that. Okay. Yeah, that's about par for the course for this team. But see, now I'm now I'm thinking we could have taken that sponsorship. <laughs> yeah, now I am badly kicking myself for the lack of sponsorship. <laughs> I mean, we. This has actually played out okay. Like, these are faster cars we're in the way of, but, like, we're way overperforming. Right. We're gonna lose places, but. If we just get one more. Yeah, you know what? Push. The rain's gonna slack again. It's gonna slack. Uh, see, it's gonna clear now toward the end. Right. So our next and final pit will be to go to... Yeah. we go full slicks at that point, or will it not have drivers? I want to make sure, like, there's no more rain coming. Right. Um, Once we have a little bit more of the forecast. Yeah. So asking one race in the wets really the signal you want to be confident about the sponsorship. It's I'm confident in our strategy. Yeah. We had a That's, good strategy. <laughs> I'm betting on us. <laughs> Alright, rain is easing. Uh track is still soaked, so we're still gonna see the best of these uh wets. I can't remember which of these dudes would be better. Because, okay, so a thing we can do, it's like the big swing. Mm -hmm. You put them on slicks while the track is drying. Oh. Like, okay. you have one, you have like one lap where you like have to drive really carefully. Right. But then you're good to go. Stephenson's in a less valuable position to us. Yeah. You pit him early is what you're saying? I am kind of tempted. Uh, the track is getting less soaked. Maybe on the next lap. Next lap yeah. around. Yeah, the, the, yeah, the water's going down.
He's going to go to Slicks. Uh, and we are on map 37. This would get us to... This would nearly get us there. Oh. Oh. Right? Yeah. But not quite. Was, does that mean we, like, we can, roll we can off change fumes? engine mode. We can change engine mode. Okay, okay. Somebody's saying the slicks won't last for 15 laps. Really? Huh. I know, I know. Uh, <laughs> it's right there. Wait a couple more. It's still, it is still wet. Maybe we do another, another lap before this pit. <sighs> yeah. And it is still technically soaked. No, fuck that. <laughs> Here we go. We're gonna, we're gonna, he's gonna be on a two stop. That's what that's what we're gonna do. He's yeah. gonna two more stops in the dry. Well, then we don't uh, need to. Yeah, we we can take as much out as we had before, right? I yeah. don't think he even needs to refuel. Does he? Again, got... with the track running slower at this point, like the track's gonna keep picking up speed, so like fuel now is gonna be cheaper. I think in terms okay. of time. Okay. Uh. Yeah. All right. I think this is. I think this is what we do. You hit that fast. You hit that fast button. Yeah. Twenty-seven no, percent. I don't. I don't. No. With this pit crew, no. <laughs> All right. How are they doing? He's got to get off those wets. That was quick. That seemed quick. Yeah, and I just wanted to conser like be conservative out there as he comes out. Um. Okay, Quintus, uh, we should hit him, no? Or one more. Yeah. Okay. Excuse me, what? Oh, everyone pit. Everyone yeah, pit. Yeah, yeah. I was like, wait a second, that can't be right. <laughs> this gets him there. It gets him there, yeah. We don't even need that last bit if you want to tick it down no. one, right? Right. There you go. Yeah, that's enough. That's enough. He'll be on point and five. He's not at the stopping. End. He's no. not stopping. No. He's going to the end. <laughs> yeah. Are the parts everything okay? Anything else we need to change? I think actually safe for the two seconds and no chance of error is the, the move. Sure, sure, yeah. Oh my god. Alright. He just needs to hang in there a little bit longer. to be expected though. Yeah. See, I would have picked fast. Just the fucking <laughs> This is... I have no idea. Oh, oh, 
No. <laughs> Other people are definitely going to need to pit. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. So Fuentes keeps... Stays on. Maybe we get a... Good little bump over here. Yeah, but he needs to be... He needs to back off these tires a little bit. They're starting to creep up in terms of temperature. people keeping up behind him i know <laughs> uh it's true but he he's on a different strategy uh yeah. or theoretically he's on a different strategy Alright, so I feel like maybe he can be a little more aggressive. Yeah. He's now like well ahead of most of the other racers on tire. Yeah. Well, so Stephenson's gonna have to stop one more time. Right. Um, all right, Fuentes, the... He's starting to lose a little too much tire temperature for my tastes. Once he goes through this... Yeah. Was our fuel guesstimate way too conservative? Like, both of these so. guys can finish. Both yeah. of these guys can finish. Yeah. I think we were just, you were conserving fuel. You, were, you had them on low engine, right? Okay, so, yeah, I mean. Now you can kind of pump it a bit. Right? Get them on overtake and stuff? I mean, the question is, like, do we try to nurse this guy home? Can we... Yeah, I think we can make it. Oh, but he's gonna have to... But he doesn't... Well, he's... No, he's... He might be able to do this. Hold on. Conserve... Conserve tire. Yeah, conserve uh, tire, but... Down. Just fucking... You can gun it on the... On the... On the fuel. Right, we have more than enough. He has... Now he does, yeah. I mean, are any... Like, some of these guys ahead may need to, may need to stop. Uh, they should. They should need to stop. One of them did. Nice. Oh man, the tire deg is falling off fast here. Uh, he's in he, real he... tire trouble. Only three more. Three more laps though. I know, I know. We can push, we can push to the end! Oh, don't get... 
Yeah, come on. Hey, chat, does this thing have a requirement where he has to have enough fuel to f cross the finish line and then get back to the pits? Because that could be bad. <laughs> He's got enough for three, and there's only two left. Yeah, we can't. I can't do. I can't help you with that, man. <laughs> Stevenson is in eighth place. Come on, son. <laughs> you got this. Hold it. <laughs> Oh, I wish we had taken that fucking sponsorship! I wish we had taken the sponsorship! Yeah, yeah, I know, I know they're wearing down. We're in it to win it! It's the last, it's the last lap! Come on! He's got, he's got excess fuel. Smoke push, him if you got him. Push it! Push it! Smoke him if you got him. Go! Go! Oh, Fuentes just passed him. Who cares? Oh my god! Without, Amazing! Strategy. Amazing! Gone! He's out of there! We should have taken that sponsorship, damn it! <laughs> They got you get they picked him at the end. They got him at the end. Yeah. yeah. But hey, ninth and eleven. Ninth and eleventh though. Is okay. So much better. <laughs> Look. We should have taken that sponsorship. We should have taken the, the money. We should have taken the sponsorship. Next one. <laughs> Next one. Okay. Oh, that was that was that was, <laughs> that was legendary. <laughs> this is this is the beginnings of a beautiful a beautiful arc of, of growth for this team, of sponsorships coming in. <laughs> that was incredible. Yeah. That was that was so. By the way, that is my preferred strategy call, or just like completely yeah. wild ha ha like hail mary plays. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's great. <laughs> So Just... yeah, hope everyone enjoyed uh, this little taste of Motorsport Manager. Um, this is, Whew. oh, this this gave me life. <laughs> oh my god, that was great. That was a great finish. You know. Yeah, that was that was some dramatic stuff. Uh, <laughs> and now I think we're gonna see that we're broke. Um, yeah, that's the problem. See how much money we have left. We're in the red. If only we had taken that sponsorship. <laughs> uh, yeah, we we should have we we should have taken the sponsor. But hey, like good vibes across the team. Everyone, it. Mm. Hey, wait, got him. Why is Gaspar sad? What? Negative. 40? Why is Gaspar sad? Why is Gaspar sad? What Guess the bar? fuck happened? <laughs> Everything else is good? Is it because he's not going to get to drive next week? <laughs> what? Is it because he's only... Wait, wait, wait. Why, why is the... Why, why happiness down? Oh, because we were expected... We wanted seventh, remember? Not every race! Yeah, I thought that was an end of... I thought that was a team at the end of... <laughs> we needed that sponsorship, Rob! We needed that money! <laughs> uh... <laughs> this even happens in my video games? <laughs> Oh my god. Well, that'll do it for the Waypoint Plus Mobile. <laughs> We're going to go record watching, a everybody. podcast. Waypointplus.com. Yeah. We need that money. <laughs> yeah. Uh, WaypointGeneralStore.com, huh? Mm, yeah. Limited time only. 
Yeah, that's about to go down soon. Yeah. Go get your bugs. And then we'll replace it with something new. Something it's good. It is, fancy. It is going to disappear like Fuentes' morale. <laughs> you uh, all right. to Fuentes! Uh, <laughs> and we'll be back with uh, more streams later this week. All made possible by our uh, supporters on Waypoint Plus. WaypointPlus.com. Thanks for watching. We gotta go pod. Peace. Bye. You want the future and the fear. You waste away everything you left behind.